Oh, look at that light. It tells you it's getting kind of late here. It's almost dark on Friday night, and uh, we've got the uh, the fishing rodeo that officially starts tomorrow morning, or tomorrow at 12.01 for anybody that's out there that's going to be fishing that early. But it's a 12.01. Um, it's late. <laughs> but um, I didn't want to put the... Uh, uh, the secret code word out there too early uh, so we're going to do that now and everybody that's uh, interested in fishing uh, in it and trying to compete for the first fish the first official fish okay with the secret code word y'all have a chance to have been ready by now and plan a trip uh, hopefully with your kids or your grandkids there's nothing like the effort being made to take a kid fishing. I love that. Um, anyhow, don't let me ramble too long. Right, tell me if I'm rambling now. Just put that in the comments down there and help me know that I ramble too much. Um, <laughs> what, what am I looking at right there? I'm looking at a piece of concrete broke off a neighbor's yard uh, driveway. Um, why am I showing you that? Because of the, the fish tags, okay? The idea behind a fish tag is that you have something that's durable. Concrete is pretty durable, but, you know, it's going to be kind of hard to carry around with you. You you don't have to make a fish tag. There's some people who think, well, maybe it's, you know, too childish or whatever. That's part of the fun, okay? If Even if you're an old man like me or an old woman, like none of you are, Okay, <laughs> but if you know a man like me, sometimes you can have a little little childish in you, and that, that keeps things fun. Um, I like arts and crafts, and I try to blend that with, with everything that I do. And so I thought, um, you know, it would be something fun you can do with your kids, something cheap, something fun. Um, and like last year, this is a quick little fish tag I made. This is out of a... Milo's tea jug, and it took me about 10 minutes elapsed time to make it. And that is my wonderful fish tag. It's made of plastic. Uh, it's fairly durable. It, the wet ain't going to hurt it. Um, you can make yours out of whatever you want to make it out of, or nothing at all. Uh, the point is, is to have something like this that you can take with you fishing and write down some important information. Uh, this piece of concrete will also, oh, if I can get down here on these knees, right, can uh, give me a nice little place to do some quick work here. Um, you want to be able to use this in, in a reusable manner, or you can uh, simply have a piece of paper, a piece of cardboard. You can write the information on your arm. Doesn't matter. Whatever you want to do, as long as it's in the video of you catching the first fish or whatever fish um, is offered up as a bonus fish, which I'm sure that there will be several of those throughout the season. Um, maybe it'll be whoever t today is about who catches the first fish, the first official fish um, in the tournament. Um, it, it, the next one may come. Somebody may want to sponsor somebody to catch the first crappie. And there will be a secret code word for that. Uh, or the first tuna. Or, or the first non-fish species. Like it would be a turtle. Or a crawfish or something like that. The point is, is to have some way with you that's easy to record what you're doing. So we can all see it. Now, somebody made the suggestion that maybe that they'll... Uh, uh, just film their phone that's got the uh, the date and the time on it in their video. That's okay too, but you won't be able to record, well, you may be able to, you need to be able to record the weight, uh, possibly, if you're going for the biggest fish, okay? Um, so you'll need to be able to record your weight, um, the time and the day, the species, the length, for anything like that so 
the idea of something like this is, I think, pretty good. And if you are a channel out there that have several children, like uh, Rim's family or uh, Ragnarok or anyone else that's got a bunch of potential fisher, fisher people out there, they can make their own fish tags. That would be awesome. So this is for, um, I'll put some duct tape on there. I can peel that off and reuse this tag. Uh, first fish is what this is for. And make sure that when you are showing your fish tag with this information, that we can see it clearly. Don't be giving us no fuzzy details. We want to be able to see this uh, just to keep everything as fair and honest and honorable as we can. The first fish. Now, you get up in the morning, whatever time, and go fishing. If, um, if you think you want to compete in this, I hope you do. And I hope you take all your kids and I hope, hope they all have their own fish tags by now. If not, use a piece of paper, do whatever, but get your kids out there fishing. Maybe, maybe, um, maybe they'll have some, some good fun and maybe you will too. So this is for the first fish. And, um, um, oh yeah, the secret code word, it's actually going to be, um, like three of them. Okay. I think you're going to like this. I think John will too. Okay. Let's see here. <laughs> Let's see if I can get it all in here. Um, Bobbers. Uh, Bobbers. Uh, R. Letter R. <laughs> uh, best. Bobbers are best. You see how I've got that? And I hope you can all see that. Bobbers are best. Yep. John may be, uh, have all his fishing equipment ready to go, right? He may have the boat ready, all the hooks ready, all his lures, and he might have some fish that he's done sweet talked into letting him be the first fish catcher. Now he's legal. He can, uh, I can too, uh, if I want to, um, but I, I always feel like I win when y'all win. That's my way of winning. If y'all are having fun and enjoying what you're doing, but you're going to have your fish tag, whatever it is, showing it with your fish. Um, after you land it, don't do like me and try to film a video while you're catching a fish. Probably be better. And then have that in there. First fish, uh, bobbers are best. That's your secret code word. And in your video, um, use, let's see, hashtag um, uh, Shed Wars Fishing Rodeo 22. And um, uh, let's see, another hashtag, uh, Shed Wars Fishing, hashtag Shed Wars Fishing. You can do that. Um, but anyhow, Put that in there. And if you want to go hashtag bobbers are best, you can put that in there. But don't let that one be like the first hashtags you use. You know, do, do it however you want to. But um, uh, you know, just make it simple. And we'll see it there. No problem. But anyhow, this has been long enough. There's your code word for the first fish bobbers are best y'all be good good luck to all of you take a kid fishing today